The full story of the kidnapping of Luis Diaz's dad is like something from Hollywood. I mean, why would ELN, a political group currently involved in peace talks with the government, kidnap the father of a football player in the first place? See, this kidnapping had been planned for months. The kidnappers had the complete schedule of Diaz's parents and kidnapped them while they were out buying watermelons. However, due to an intense police search, they left the mother behind and fled with Diaz's father into the Colombian forest from where they could cross the border to Venezuela. ELN, considered a terrorist organization, have been in peace talks with the government for ages now. But to get fundings for their operations, these groups kidnap people from time to time to get ransom. However, in this scenario, due to the wide media exposure, pressure and protests that Luis Diaz brought, they were found out before they could even ask for a ransom. With the Colombian military hot on their trial, they released a statement saying kidnapping the man was a mistake and finally handed him over to a UN group yesterday. And now thankfully, Diaz Sr. is safely home after the craziest 12 days of his life.